Hello everybody, welcome back to our Season 2 Journey Through Azeroth. I'm your host Valen4. This little chappy here is of course Tembok Bali. And we're getting into it here. You may recall in the last episode we finished off uh, just over in this way. We picked up a couple more quests. Uh, I've got some stuff to loot by the looks of things here. Uh, and I have gone and just placed a few items on the auction house. Uh, we're rocking DPS spec at the present time. Um, as you know, we, we did have a little try at our tank spec as well. That does seem to do quite well. Um, but obviously for questing and the likes, I think we'll probably stick to doing um, DPS spec. Now the reason I say that is because whilst things did appear to go down fairly quickly in tank spec, in reality they don't go down as quick as they do when we're not in tank spec. DPS spec, for example. These things just go down two hits, done and dusted. Like that, or in one hit. So that's pretty cool. Um, I still have none of the secondary um, professions. I need to pick those up at some stage. I also need to get to smelting as well. Uh, so in any case, let's wrap this up here. And hopefully today we will get off this island. Ooh, we've got a new pouch there. Another six slot, that's nice. So we've now got two six slots. Just finish off this guy. There we are, right. What up? Be good. Boom. That'll be a ding. Boots of courage. They seem to be better. Obviously we're dealing with crappy stuff at the moment. Um I don't think I've picked up anything else that's decent at the present time. Uh, speak to Delora Lionheart. Okay. Roll our way over here. And we have a new ability as well, Provoke. Taunts the target, causes them to move forwards towards you. Okay. So that's a tanking taunt, essentially. For some reason, as well, I've just noticed that my uh, action bars keep disappearing. Don't know why that is. Maybe there's a bug in game at the moment. So with a name like Delora Lionheart, I would imagine that these are alliance peeps as opposed to horde peeps. It does look that way. Ah, and there's also blacksmith as well, so I can actually repair some of my gear. I doubt it needs repairing much, though, to be fair. There's Jojo. You have our favor, Pandaren. Right. None left behind. What's this? Rescue three injured sailors. Okay. Medical supplies. Recover I eight like crates. Greetings. Now, because we're holding on to a load of tats, let's get rid of some of this. Don't need any of these. Yeah, or that, or that. Well, that, 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 that. Don't need a mushroom. Don't need the boots. The belt, the earth root will hold on to. Let's just tidy up our bags here. And I like that there. Like that. Okay, fantastic. Didn't actually have anything to repair. down. Eight deep scale Until tormentors. Next time. Okay. Let's get to it. Heal this chappy. Hey, what? Oh, I've got. To, I've got to carry them back, do I? There you are, my friend. Can I grab the supplies whilst I have a chap attached to me? I can. Fantastic. Okay. 
Can I roll with an injured sailor though, I wonder? I can! <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, there's another one. Um, and there is one up here as well, so let's go and do that. Get that out the way, done and dusted. One for you, one for you, one for you, there we go. Grab him. Roll our way back. You are welcome among us, Pandaren. You Might have well our hand favor, that in. Pandaren. And then all we need to do is collect stuff and kill stuff. Grab this and this. I have no fear in these things. They're just going to go down. Nice and low level. Right, it's two more medical supplies and one more deep scale chappy. There's one here. Boom. Foot to the face. And that is all she wrote. Right, so we're going to take these back. And what else have we got here? So Fist of Fury at level 20 for this one. Our next one's Stagger. Okay. You are welcome among us, Pandaren. Hand that in. Mm -hmm. Hand that in. Uh, defeat Vordraka, the deep sea nightmare. Goodbye. Okay. Oh. And he has literally just spawned in. He wasn't there earlier. Alright, let's start doing some damage then. Thank Shenzhen Su that you are here. I could use your help. Get clear when it raises its weapon. It's even stronger than it looks. It is calling allies. I'll keep it wearing him down. Keep it up. Let's get rid of some of these guys. Whoa. Hey mates, there we go. I would have done without you. It's good that you came. Thanks. Hand in to you, do I? Yeah. It's good to see you. Boom. Remove the thorn from Shen Sin Su. I guess I'm going to have to place some uh, if we let him explosives, am I? Come with me quickly. That's what I imagine is going to happen here. They're going to. Place the explosives we collected and blow this thing off its side, maybe? Yeah, look. Jeez, I knew stop! It. This is reckless and stupid! Asa, this is our only option. We blow the ship free, then we heal his wound. Yeah, exactly. We have no other solution. If you stop this, then maybe we can come up with one. So we just wait until we think of something? Guys, the fuses Shen are lit. Shen Su is dying. Doing nothing risks everything. Doing this risks everything. I'd rather die knowing that at least we tried. Gee, if this is what you must do, I will not stop you. But we could lose everything. I hope you are right. Blah. I take it we're running, yes? Okay, there wasn't that many. He is 
dying. His wounds can be healed. I hope you can forgive yourself for what you have done to him. Wow. Okay. Pretty sure we can heal that Come wound, though. Front. You keep my priests safe. Let's get rid of some of these idiots, because... Thank you. Right. That runoff. Healers Find active. Healer Three of twelve. Get them free of the fight. We need them here at the wound. Okay, well, let's go and get them. Rescue them. Save them. Whatever it is. Right. Priesty. Get to it. Priesty, get to it. We stand by your side, friend. This battle is not yours alone. Uh. Aha, aha. There we go. Just gonna get some more of these healers going. Whoa, 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 no. Get to it, pumpkin. Whoa, I don't wanna be doing that right now. We'll have a look at these in a second. Let me move this up here and that there. We've got a res. Um, right. Get to healing. It's uh, 6 of 12. 7 of 12. 8 of 12, probably. Can you let me attack these things, please? Wow! So many of them. Get to it. There we go. He is protected. And the time to act is always now. And what have we got here? Some new legs. It's working. <coughs> the wound is closing. We risked everything, but we did it. Shenzhen Su will be okay. Ah. Well, would you look at that? True phasing right there. Let's get those on. What else have we picked up here that's probably a load of tap? Yeah, belt and some other crap. Okay. It's good to see. Uh, return to the Temple of Five Dawns. Cart is waiting near the wreck of the Sky Seeker. Uh, okay. The Alliance and the Horde seem to be I bear your presence okay at the only moment. as a kindness to our new allies. Do not push me, human. Stand down, Torin, before I put you back in chains. Alright, well you could you two can just talk to one another. I'm gonna hop onto this cart and head back to the Temple of the Five Dawns. That should I think then place us at the end of this area. And I think it's here that we're going to end up having to uh, decide who it is we're going with. Of course, the decision for us has actually already been made. Weirdly, though, already level 14. Now, the starting areas, I think, generally take you to around level 10. So we're already seeing the benefits of um, 
our stuff here. A couple of new uh, skills that we just got when we levelled up to 14. We've got Resuscitate, which returns the spirit to the body, restoring a dead target to life with 35% maximum health and mana. Can't be cast whilst in combat, so it's a non-combat res. Uh, so that's useful. Then we've got this one. Zen Pilgrimage. Your spirit travels to your home temple, leaving your body behind. Use Zen Pilgrimage again to return back to near your departure point. This is what we can use to go on the Zen Pilgrimage, as it's called. <coughs> and that's how we get the two hour, or one hour buff, I think it is, for uh, like additional 50% experience. Don't know if it's from just kills or quests or everything. But that's how we're going to be levelling up, like, ridiculously fast. Stacks with rested experience as well. So it's going to be amazing. But, uh, maybe we should try it. Let's, let's go and have a look at what this Zen Pilgrimage is all about. Okay, that did absolute diddly squat. So I'm assuming then you can't use it whilst in this starter area. We've got to actually um, leave this place. So I may as well just continue for now. Get this bit done. That's a tour room. My time is passing. So speak to the spirit of Master Shang Zi and choose whether you leave with the Alliance or the Horde. You all accomplished a great thing. I'm ready to decide. So the proud nations of the Horde are loosely joined in an alliance of convenience against a hostile world that we destroyed. Focused, ferocious, and sometimes monstrous, the Horde values strength and honor but struggles to keep aggression in check. Join the Horde, fight to build a world where their people can live free. Master Shang Zi, I would like to accompany. Awesome. What a, what a fantastic cinematic. I thought they only implemented like the cinematic element into the game. The expansion after Pandaria. What was that now? Was that Warlords of Drena? Uh, the thing is, you know, the, these expansions just end up rolling into one. Uh, we had Burning Crusade, Wrath of the Lich King, Cataclysm, Pandaria. I guess the next one was Warlords of Draenor, but... I'm with you. Here we are, our new home. Welcome. Apparently. Oh. And there we go, that's a little bit of um, history for you here. This is when Garrosh Hellscream was the um, war chief. So it's after Thrall, before. Vulgin. Vulgin? Yeah. And then, uh. Of course, Sylvanas, but. It's incredible. Okay, so what have we got here? Orc Commoner, I think that's for the beer event that's currently on. What do we have here? Azara Northern Barons, neither of which I actually want to do because we're heading over to Eastern Kingdoms this time. And um, what does the Earthen Ring want with us, I wonder? Uh, no, that's Northern Barons it. again. So, oh, there's Sourfang. What do you need? I believe it's Go. Sourfang's son the horde. that was turned to a Death Knight. Uh, walk with Garrosh, okay. You've made a wise decision to join my horde. Have there I? are some that would call us barbarians, the mongrel races of Azeroth. They are ignorant and blind to reality. 
Look around you, Pandaren. You will find no better partner in battle than an orc. The Turin have made themselves useful. Look, this one is a shaman. Even a blood elf can hold a sword. Do you see it? Everyone in my horde earns their keep. You and your friends will be no exception. Do you understand this, Pandaren? Yes, Warchief. <laughs> Good. Moving on. I know that you are not the only Pandaren to escape from that island. Some of your kind chose to join the Alliance. <coughs> they are now your enemies. You may have had friends and kin who chose to cast their lot with the enemies of the Horde. They are no longer your friends, no longer your family. Wow, the good. minute they put on that Alliance tabard, they died. I will not tolerate any lingering ties across enemy lines. Traitors to the Horde will die a traitor's death. Do I make myself clear? I... I believe so. Yes. Good. Wow. Scary guy. Our enemies will fall. We will have justice. Let's just hand that in. He hasn't really told us where to go from this point onwards, and of course this is where you'd normally pick up the other stuff, like, um, you know, the stuff down here. What I want to do is pick up cooking, fishing, all that good stuff, most of which I will end up doing uh, outside of uh, recording. And the other thing is I want to try and find a uh, vendor for the tabard for Ogrimmar as well. Uh, other contents, profession trainers. Let's try uh, first aid so, uh, over Go that way. Now because I've... Well, I mean... <laughs> okay, so I said ages ago that never played the Horde side. That's... a a little bit of a lie. I have played a very, very small amount of the Horde side. By very small, I mean like the beginning areas. I haven't done anything other than that. Ooh, I'll tell you what we could do whilst we're here, though. Let us... Where's my... It's in here, isn't it? There we go. Smelt up some copper. And then I'll just talk quickly whilst uh, that's going on. So I've played through the starting areas of, I think, nearly all of the Horde races years and years and years ago. But that was the the limit of my knowledge. I think the only Horde city that I actually know, like the back of my hand, is Silvermoon. Um, the Blood Elf's starting city. And that's because I played through a Blood Elf um, character a number of times. Starting area is actually quite fun because it involves a lot of the um, undead. Because it was an area that was hit fairly heavily by um, Arthas, the Lich King. Back in Warcraft 3, in fact. But yeah, Ogrimmar. I think I went through it once as an alliance character to try and take down Thrall when they were still doing the whole take down the enemy um, you know the, the uh, I don't know uh, enemy leaders that was it you had to go to each of the different faction cities and, and take down each of their leaders but um, yeah long 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 time ago and uh, I can just about find my way around Stormwind, to be perfectly honest with you. So learning these new cities um, is going to possibly take some time, but I'm sure we'll get there in the end. Right, so we're almost finished with smelting here. And we 
got up to 59, so that's not too bad. What do you need? I can now smelt bronze tin and get our next level of mining. So that's cool. That is cool. Okay. Um, Guildmaster Tabard Vendor. There we go. Greetings. Uh, let me browse your wares. Um, wow, this is going to... This is going to knock me for six. And I say this is the right... Uh, oh yeah, look, that was when the 2006 Olympics were on. No, 2008. 2006? One of the two. I can't remember when the Olympics were on now. But... Um, Let's just sell some of this tat that we're holding on to here. Let's move that down. I thought she would have the Ogrimmar tabard, but it turns out she does not. So I've still got to find that. Uh, guild vendor doesn't have anything. Guild master. I am in a guild, am I not? No. I thought I was. Guild finder. I obviously I'm not yet in a guild. I thought I was, that was weird. Well, in any case, we're trying to find the healing area. Now, where the heck is that? So it looks like it's up here. Up here. And through here, maybe? I still need to try and find... Ah! No, that that's... Combatant. Combatant. Mount Quartermaster. Alright. War Mount. What, what is this place? Hall of Legends. It's probably a PvP uh, element, I would imagine. Legacy Weapon Quartermaster. Accessories Quartermaster. What brings you here? Mark of Honor. Okay. Drink honor. Uh, upgraded Dwarven Hand Cannon. Yeah. None of this I need or want. Uh, what I'm looking for, though, is the Ogrimmar Vendor, whatever it is. I know with this, I can. Uh, in my mind's eye, I can immediately recall where the Stormwind one is. And this is the problem, isn't it, of course, not knowing where you are. So if there's anyone at the moment following along at home, you're going to be in pretty much the same situation as I am, not knowing where things are. So obviously, by all means, follow along, but um, don't expect this me to know where I'm going. Itself. He sells a thick hide pack, but they're blooming expensive. Pleasure doing business with you. Hunter trainer who just happens to be fishing. Trade supplies. Maybe this is going to be the area where we're going to end up finding stuff. Um, Goblin products are built to cooking trainer. Hey, how you doing? Buy all of that. Glad I could Have help. I got a deal and, for you. Uh, let's drag cooking onto our thing here the greatest virtue is the will to act and then what do we need here mild spices let's get no not five whoa okay uh 40 and 40 and let's create all of those uh, because of our pandaren uh racial we actually start cooking a little bit higher than normal. I think an uh, additional 15 points. So that's nice. This is probably only going to get us to about 40, I think, cooking. Let's get rid of those you two. I've seen you around here before. We might be able to get higher. It just really all depends.
I think I used to get spice bread up to about the 50 mark, but it goes yellow at 40, I think. Oh, okay. It's looking good. Okay, yellow at 45. If we can get to 50, that would be amazing. 48. 49. Hey, there we go. Fantastic. Okay, make that unavailable again. Get the latest thingy. And that's Get all of our spice bread side. done. I can now sell those. Hey, got a new shipment. Come Nothing else we can cook at the moment. And let's, I guess, just continue along. Riding trainer. It's my way for the highway. Can't get riding yet. You ever need any trike dealer? I know a buyer when I it's see. Pretty cool. Uh, and we also have another mining trainer over here. Now wait, 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 wait. I was under the impression that there was a first aid trainer around here somewhere. There it is. I ain't getting paid to chat. Let's do that. Do not get on Gallywix's bed. Fantastic. Okay, so the only other thing around here then that we've not yet got is fishing, which I would have thought was around here somewhere. It seems to be the perfect place for a, a fishing trainer to be. There's also a pet battle trainer. Yeah, yeah. Jade Crane Chick. Don't appear to have that, so let's grab that. Keep your ear to the ground. And See those around, are friend. pet battle stones, so that's fine. Uh, we've got some bankers here, dirty bankers, and <laughs> we've also got an auctioneer. I got what you need. So look, we've got some auctions up at the moment. Um, let's see, what can we get for this per unit? Fifteen copper. Um, really, really, search. Yeah, okay, I'll put those up via the app because the app actually um, it actually gives you a lot better um, rates, let's say. I still need this um, Blumen Tabard. Cooking supplies, cooking trainers, other cooking trainers over there. Fishing trainer, there we go. Who you be? Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Oversized bobber. I don't, of course, need a fishing pole, so that's fine. I did see a snake trainer a second ago, didn't I? Trade supplies, no. Innkeeper. Rogue trainer again. Let's see if we've got these snakes. How you do it? Crimson Snake, Black King Snake, and Brown Snake. Yeah, we've got all of those. Okay. Well, I guess let's head back to the Valley of Strength and see if we can't find the um, Ogrimmar vendor for the tabards. The reason I'm trying to get uh, a tabard and like actually making a massive point of needing a tabard. It's because when it comes to doing dungeons and stuff, we can be earning additional rep for Ogrimmar. They are the ones that focus on our um, riding skill. The sooner we can get exalted with uh, Ogrimmar, the better. And let's just actually check in here to make damn sure I'm not actually missing anything. Uh, tabards. Thunderbluff, Darkspear, Ogrimmar. Ogrimmar. But where... No, that's an elevator that takes us up. That's not what we're looking for. Uh, 
expect there'll be quite a few people screaming in the comments later going, why didn't you just go on like the trade chat? Um, and yeah, could have done. I want to try and find these things for myself. It's the brew club nope. meat vendor. No, Go not interested. Dark spear headhunter. Maybe ask this person. I've spelt Orgrima wrong. I've spelt it Ogrima. Don't even think that person's listening to me. Oh dear. Well, this isn't going so well, is it? I wanted to get out to uh, our next questing zone, but at the moment I'm just wasting time. Not purposely. Let me uh, let me see if I can ask these people. And uh, it seems these guys are actually um, of course. <laughs> they seem to be role playing. Need to learn how to read maps. idea what they're talking about. Well, you're actually seeing an RP element here because these guys are actually role-playing. Uh, defend me, yeah. Uh, I'm in the, I'm in the city. There's nothing that's going to attack me here. But I mean, I, I guess, in a way, this is nice that these people have uh, helping me out. She's also making a point that, of saying, you can ask a guard for directions. I already knew that, know this. I think they think I'm a new player, which is kind of sweet. See, there are actually really nice people that play. And this is the thing that I've been reading recently as well. Although, you know, there is an element of good and evil um, between the Alliance and the Horde. People, I think, assume the Horde would be evil. And that the Horde... Or, uh, that the Alliance are good but in reality I think that the Horde have a lot more mature It's 
give her what you may only you may only trade to players from other realms You being in this world is the gift I need. Ah, oh, bless. Guaranteed, this it's going to be a male. It's okay, so we can get the bilge water cartel tabard. I suppose we may hey, as well buy it. that. I got mouth to feed, pal. Next time, I'm mine. Okay, so we can stop walking. Can That's what I wanted. And we may as well grab that as well. We're spending a lot of our money here though. Let's get the Ogrimmar Tabard on straight away. <coughs> Excuse me, right. That's only Ogrimmar, uh, that one and that one. I'm not seeing a tour on one though. Which is very, very strange. Um, Darkmoon Fair appears to be on at the moment, by the looks of things as well. Yes, it is. We'll leave Darkmoon Fair for now. What we will do, however, is just go and have a little look over here. This is the Battle Pet Trainer. What can I help you with? Uh, he doesn't have any For other the rare horde. thingies, but Outland, Northrend, Cataclysm, what we've been training for. Defeat 10 players who define it. No, Strength. we're not interested. Loktar. These are, of course, I think. Be safe. Like account bound or something. Dagger of the Fierce. Yeah. McGraw. Doesn't appear to have uh, Northrend or May your blades uh, never Northrend. Dawn. What am I chatting about? I don't mean Northrend, guys and girls. I mean, it doesn't appear to have. Um, Lotar. No connecting flight Dabu. points. Okay. What am I trying to say? Someone please give me some inspiration to my brain because it's hurting at the moment and I don't know what I was trying to say. Um, Alright, let me just <laughs> give my brain a second to catch up here. Uh, what we're going to do before we finish off today is we're going to head out of here um, and over to, I think, the Zeppelin port over here. See if we can get over to Eastern Kingdoms. It should land us just outside of um, Undercity. And then we can get cracking with some quests over there. I believe where we're going to head to, let me just show you quickly. Uh, we're going to end up not there. We are going to end up in Tirisful Glades. Down here somewhere, under cities, just there. And then from there, we will head down into Silver Pine Forest. This is where we're going to be questing. Then into Hillsbrad, Arathi Highlands, Hinterlands, Western Plaguelands, Eastern Plaguelands. Um, and then I think it's down to the likes of Badlands, Burning Steps blasted lands there is also of course this bit down here uh, Duskwood for example uh, Stranglethorn Vale north and south uh, lots of pirates in Stranglethorn um, and lots of undead stuff at the northern points but the other thing is of course we can also do dungeons although the dungeon finder isn't available until level 15 Right, let's get over to the Zeppelin Tower, which I think is there. That might even be it there. Of 
course it might not necessarily be there. Well, I know that there is a Zeppelin tower somewhere here. I have no idea if this is the Zeppelin tower or not. Let's have a look. And of course, we do have. Is that it? It's just a tower. Well, that doesn't help me. Alright, okay. I'm guessing it's this one over here then. Though that doesn't much look like a Zeppelin tower. Oh, there's Argus in the sky. Uh, Alright, okay. I. I uh, this is the thing, it's been so long since I played this, I have absolutely no idea where I'm going or what I'm doing. Maybe it might be an idea to have a look at this Zen pilgrimage thing that we were trying to look at earlier before we finish off for today. I've got a feeling we've been running for about 45 minutes now, so it's probably wisest that I uh, call time out soon. Let's just have a look quickly at what the Zen pilgrimage thing was all about. I think this is taking us to an area within the Mists of Pandaria main um, islands as opposed to the floating turtle, but I can't recall. Yeah, look, we're in Kunlai Summit, the Shrine of the Ox. So technically we're in a level, what is this, 87 to 88 zone. This allows us to go back to Ogremar. There is also Stormwind over there, which of course we can't use. Uh, and as I say, this just allows us to hear the Peak of Serenity. There are daily quests, but I don't believe the day. Whoa, that was silly. Don't believe the daily quests are available until level twenty. Um, so that's fine. Let's just roll our way to victory over here. Let me just have a look. Yeah, daily quests not available yet can't do anything here either so I may as well uh, instead of using my Zen pilgrimage to get back let's just take the portal because at least then we will get the uh, experience boost whilst we're here and what I will do before we finish off here for today is ask a guard about getting to another continent because that will tell me where to go other continents uh, Thunder Bluff to yeah, Wait, Ogrimar, Under City or Silvermoon? That's where we're trying to get to. To get to Under City or Silvermoon, you should seek out Reza on the Eastern Zeppelin Tower atop the Central Plateau in Ogrimar. Oh, okay. So the Zeppelin Tower is now inside of Ogrimar. It used to be on the outside. That shows how long ago it was that I last did this because I cannot remember it being there. And there's also a daily fishing. Uh, thing to do over here as well so maybe we'll pick this up and do this next time but guys this is where we're going to have to end for today I really hope you've enjoyed this one if you have please do all those lovely social media things please like, comment, share, subscribe if you are new to the channel and I will see you next time for more in our Journey Through Azeroth Season 2 but until then take care and I'll see you next time bye bye for now